Yep. And so 100% attribution is not possible. A lot of that is influenced through content, to, through these organic channels. Um, I think people can get directionally there. Like we made these investments and we've been doing these things in the same way that I say, like we've been doing this for the past year and a half and I can, I can see the directional or correlated results from that. Um, or at least I can see like some fraction of the touch points, right? You can see likes, you can see comments, you can see those inbound DMs, you can see who's visiting your site. Um, and so even if it's not one-to-one, -one, um, like an email sequence, um, you can at least be like, Hey, like we're capturing like 30 of the touch points. And that's good enough for me to know that this is working in your mind. What do you need to say to a company or to an organization to help change their mind mindset to be like, Hey, like this is how you should be thinking about things, um, moving forward and what you're doing right now, um, maybe is not going to scale because I think there are lots of companies which are like, okay, short term, I'm six months into this. Um, I am seeing a marginal improvement for, by throwing another headcount at it. How do you convince them like, Hey, like this is maybe another way you want to think about solving acquisition. Yeah, for sure. I think that's, a, sorry. Oh, hey, can you hear me still? Okay. Seems you can like just, have a, yeah, I'll keep this part out, but you can um, keep speaking by the way. Like, to, really to get started on the, all right. Sounds good. So question is, uh, how can, um, what does it take to start convincing companies of, um, uh, push like, like th this is the model that we need to shift to. Is that correct? Um, so I think, first of all, that's a puzzle I'm still trying to figure out, but I think like what we can, like where we can start is that we can agree that some things like aren't working like right off the bat, right? Like an example is if you are like, there are so many horror stories of all these startups who hired all these SDRs and, and, and account executives they expanded their sales team in order to acquire customers. And then they ended up like not hitting their goals, having to fire all these people. I think it's really clear, like, okay, like this is not working, right? Number one, like we should try a different model. The second thing in terms of how, how we can like make a business case, like for this is that if like what I've been doing is sort of like building out. ROI models for, for these companies and saying like, look, okay. Uh, the immediate benefit of building your own audience is that you're going to get a lot of engagements and views that otherwise you would have to pay a lot of money for. Right. So what I've seen like internally at companies I worked at is that marketing teams are happy to spend like hundreds of, of thousands of dollars on paid ads to deliver their content. And it's not delivering like any deals. Right. So there's already money that is being spent. Um, and if you think about, okay, we're paying, you know, X thousand of dollars to get in front of like 50,000 of our ideal customer. Um, and then what if you had just built an audience of 50 customers, you know, who trust you, um, who trust what you put out and when it comes, and if you spend time investing in that, A, you're going to save immediate money by not, by turning off paid ads. Um, and then number two, when, when it becomes time, like, you know, three months, four months down the line, when you built trust, you built awareness, um, you know, and they need to purchase a solution, uh, you know, in your ROI model, you can just model out like, okay, you know, let's say we like, let's very conservatively think that in six months we can get like one, two or three deals from this then this will be worth our time, right? And I think like that's a good time frame to evaluate like a, a content initiative like this um, to start seeing like progress. And I also think that's a good way to justify the short-term like investment. Um, you know, if you're gonna get 50 views, how much would you pay for that versus just building your own audience?